Hello, I'm Dr. Korn from FastCare Urgent Care, and in this video, we are going to talk about dehydration. Dehydration is a condition which can be defined as an excessive loss of body fluids, mainly water. It usually occurs when more fluids are lost than taken in, and the body does not have enough fluids and water to carry out its functions. Dehydration, if severe, can be a serious problem. Prolonged activity without the intake of water can cause dehydration. Diarrhea, hypertension, alcohol intake, and diseases like viruses and bacteria can also lead to dehydration. Malnutrition can make dehydration severe. There are three main types of dehydration based on fluid loss. Hypotonic, it is basically the loss of electrolytes, mainly sodium. Hypertonic, this is when there is a loss of water. Isotonic, when both water as well as electrolytes are insufficient. These three types of dehydration are classified according to the severity of the condition. Mild, when the body has lost about 2% of its total fluid, it results in mild dehydration. Moderate, when the body has lost about 5% of its total fluid, it results in moderate dehydration. Severe, when the body has lost about 10% of its total fluid, it results in severe dehydration. Severe dehydration is considered an emergency. There are many reasons due to which a person can get dehydrated. Some of the major reasons are vomiting, high fever, increased and frequent urination, excessive sweating, and extreme diarrhea. Another reason may be inadequate intake of water during humid weather or during a workout or some physical activity. The symptoms of mild to moderate dehydration are sticky and dry mouth, thirst, headache, dizziness, weakening of the muscles, few or no tears when crying, and lack of energy. The symptoms of severe dehydration, which is considered a medical emergency, are extreme thirst, lack of sweating, sunken eyes, very dry mouth, irritation, confusion, low blood pressure, rapid heartbeat, fever, extreme fussiness or sleepiness in children and infants in extreme cases, dehydration results in delirium or unconsciousness. The plain and simple solution is to drink water at frequent intervals. During humid weather, there is excessive loss of body fluids through the lungs or by sweat. So rehydration drinks should be taken to avoid getting dehydrated. Caffeine and aerated drinks should be avoided as they increase the urine output and makes us dehydrate at a faster rate. Alcohol should also be avoided as it increases the rate of dehydration. In working out, water intake should be increased. Oral rehydration solution is also a remedy to stay hydrated. To increase the water level in the body, consumption of proper fluids will increase the water level in the body. During prolonged physical activity, water consumption should be more as it cleanses the system and flushes out the toxins, lubricates the joints, and aids the digestive system. For further information, you can visit us. We have a wonderful staff that will love to take care of you and walk-ins are always welcomed. You can visit us at our clinic Fast Care in our Miami Beach location at 825 Arthur Godfrey Road, Suite 100, Miami Beach, Florida, 33140, or you can visit us in our Aventura location at 20601 East Dixie Highway, Suite 340, Aventura, Florida, 33180. So if you like the videos like this one, please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. I'm Dr. Matthew Korn and thank you for watching.